Jacob Casper, Jacob Casper of Duke in the blue. Duke alum taking on Iowa State alum, NCAA champion Kyvin Gadsden in the red. And Gadsden in on a single leg, has it elevated. Casper is able to clear and takes Gadsden out of bounds in a 1-0 lead for Casper. Kyvin Gadsden's been sitting behind Kyle Snyder these last few years. Kyle Snyder, of course, multiple time world champion, also an Olympic champion. Got a couple other world medals that aren't gold as well. And Gadsden's been the guy right behind him at this weight class. Nice shot attempt there from Casper and good kick out from Gadsden. So Gadsden, somewhat of a target on his back. Maybe not quite as much as Snyder, but guys would love to knock him off and try to put themselves in the conversation at this weight class. Minute gone by, Casper still the 1-0 lead. Fresh start here. Halfway through this first period, still just the one point on the board for Casper. Gadsden looks at a single leg. Casper, good sprawl, it's not there. Nice second attempt there from Gadsden. He gets the single leg elevated. Gadsden earns the point for the step out. Casper being cornered by the Wolfpack guys. And Casper, nice reaction. Gadsden kind of slipped off that snap and Casper gets the takedown. He goes up 3-1 and now he's working on a gut wrench. Casper has a pretty dangerous gut wrench. Saw him hit this at the Bill Farrell a little bit. And now he switches to that leg. He's got the leg in, trying to open Gadsden up, but we'll come back to our feet. Low shot there for Casper. Nice job. Gets the takedown. Extends his lead. He now is up 5 to 1. <laughs> 30 seconds left in the period. Gadsden gets in deep on a shot. Looks to elevate. We're off the mat, the table was spared. Gadsden gets the one point on the step out. It's now 5-2, and you saw a glimpse of that power that Gadsden can demonstrate. Nice snap there from Casper. Gadsden dives in on a leg, short time. These guys will look to avoid giving up points. Would love to sneak a couple of points in in the last few seconds. And time runs out on the first period. Heading to the 30 second break and Jacob Casper got to be feeling pretty good up 5-2. Gadsden getting toweled off in the corner by Willie Miklas while he gets instruction from Nate Carr. Not a bad guy to have in your corner, Nate Carr. Casper, of course, being cornered by the NC State crew. Back to action, second period. Casper stalking Gadsden. He's been able to successfully get on that low level shot a couple times. And now we have a verbal warning on Gadsden for that finger fight. Can't do that. Level change there for Casper. Next up on map two, women's freestyle 76 
kilogram quarterfinals, Randy Phelps, Army W Cat, Jessica Rodier, Leather Dog, Phelps and Rodier. Gatson times that reach and he's maybe thinking about trying to explode through one of those high crotches again. Now he gets to a low level shot. Gadsden finishes, goes up four or five, and he's got leg lace. He could put Casper in all kinds of trouble here. Casper trying to defend. Gadsden really wants this to go, but he can't get it. It's five four. We'll go back to our feet. Casper now in on a low level shot. Gatson locked through the crotch. Casper looks like he's feeling the danger and he may just try to settle for a stalemate. That's what happens, they'll go back up to their feet. Gadsden needs to score to win. Casper with a 5-4 lead. Gadsden's gotten in deep on a couple of shots. One ended up out of bounds for the step out. The other was a low single. And it's Casper who dives on a shot instead. And Gadsden with the chest wrap takes a look at the clock. He can score from here. Instead, clears the position, comes back up to his feet. 30 seconds to go. Jacob Casper trying to knock off the top seed. Looks at the ref, didn't like that hand fight action there. And Gadsden looks for a shot. Nice level change from Casper. Gadsden picking up his speed. 15 to go. Casper, oh wow. Gadsden runs through Casper on the re attack. Goes up 6 5 with 10 seconds to go. Gadsden with that gut wrench. And Casper's asking the official to bring him back up. Not really how it works. There's only one second left on the board. Casper frustrated, but man, you give up a takedown late in the match, it's tough. And Kyvin Gadsden trailed much of the match, but he came from behind and got the win in the final 20 seconds. And he's moving on to the semi 